our second main topic today. And our second main topic today is this. So we have um, this. Oh, sorry here. If I can get my computer to work with me. We have this Tomb Raider movie a few years ago, 2018, 2019-ish. Uh, yeah, I actually own it on 4K. Was it really? And have I feel never, like it was longer. Uh, maybe. With like Alicia Vikander. Maybe. Whatever, yeah. Maybe 2017. I'll, I'll get it for yeah, you. Yeah, yeah, look you it up. It, it, does, it doesn't seem like it was that long ago. Like 2018. Yeah, yeah okay, right. there you go. So 2018. Um, I have it on 4K. Never seen it. Heard great things about it. Love the Tomb Raider franchise. Um, video game franchise, obviously, too, on the yeah, uh, talk of adaptions and video games. Um, obviously loved Angelina Jolie playing that character back in the day. Uh -huh. You know, uh, who didn't? Um, but... Yeah, we have some new news, it looks like, um, coming to us. If I can get, again, my computer here to to uh, work with me. We have some news coming to us from the Hollywood Reporter that it looks like um, uh, a new Tomb Raider series is in the works currently at Amazon Studios. Let's read a little bit of this. The Emmy-winning Fleabag grad is ready is readying a TV series based on the popular video game turn action movie Tomb Raider. The project, which is in the developmental stages, is the latest to stem from Waller Bridge's recently renewed overall deal with the retail giant and streamer. Sources tell The Hollywood Reporter that Waller Bridge is attached to write the scripts for Tomb Raider. Waller Bridge does not plan to star in the ad TV adaption of the property, which has spawned a 2001 and 2018 film adaption starring Angelina Jolie and a Alicia Vikander, uh, respectively, as the adventurous archaeologist. The, the Laura Croft character was also voiced by actress uh, Camilla Luddington, Keely Hawes, and Minnie Driver in a slew of video game titles. Of course, um, Haley Atwell also brought the character to life in the Netflix animated series. Wow, I did not know that. In addition to writing, Waller Bridge will executive produce the Amazon, uh, the Amazon take alongside former head of... Con uh, comedy and drama Ryan and Dolina and former head of overall deals Amanda Greenblatt um, it looks like Amazon did not immediately respond to them about like any kind of dates or what would be going on soon with this so this is kind of all we know is that we have um, the the the, the uh, Waller Bridge from Fleabag she's going to be writing creating and making this series um, it this this is kind of interesting, right? Because again, we're in this world of if we know it, then let's take our chance at it because it's all IP driven. Um, you know, Top Gun just made a billion, a billion and a half just dollars. Got nominated for Oscars. Um, and then look, as we just in our last topic, we're talking about The Last of Us being the greatest video game adapted thing ever, and it is into a TV show. So, man, who knows how this can turn out? Um, it could be anything. So I'm excited to see where this goes. And, yeah, Lucas, you're hearing this. What are your thoughts, man? Um, yeah, I, I mean, it, it really is uh, – it's an IP world out there. But, I, man, I love Tomb Raider. Um, I loved playing it with, you know, on the PS1 growing up. I loved the, I mean, Angelina Jolie as Tomb Raider is one of my first crushes. You know what I mean? Uh, and then, yeah, the, I, the 2018 one was pretty good. I love the the new video games. Those are awesome. So this, I mean, this is pretty great news. Like, it's not a ton of news really to go yeah. off of. It's just like, hey, this is it's coming down the pipeline or it's working, right? But that's awesome. I mean... It, it's probably not uh, totally coincidental that The Last of Us is coming out to rave reviews and now Amazon's like, oh, hey, by the way, we're right. yeah, thinking no of doubt. doing this. But, right. you know, we live in the golden age of television. For sure. P probably like platinum diamond age at this point. It just seems like we've been in the golden age and we ke it keeps getting better. But, like, I, I think people have finally figured out the just overall benefit to the long-form um, nature of television. You know what I mean? Like maybe the reason that all of these book to movie adaptations and especially video game adaptations have failed so often is because there's so much like to go off of that one movie, one two hour movie is not going to yeah. satisfy people. And, and, you know, you really want to do like, 
my thing with, you know, the whole IP world that we're living in is great. Keep it coming. As long as there's like true care and dedication and love of the character and what they're doing and they're not just doing it because they're, they're going to make a buck. I mean, obviously the studios care about that, but I mean the artists actually creating it, you know, then great. This let's, That'd be awesome. I'd love to see an, a really well done Tomb Raider TV series. Yeah, for Hell sure. Yeah, yeah for I mean, sure. Amazon's got and a Amazon great budget has a track too. record, man. I yeah, mean, they, they have the boys, they have the Invincible, they have things Rings that of power. We, yeah, right, right, right. Yeah, they have lots of things that people love, man. Mm -hmm. So, so I could see this. I could see this doing doing being like a big hit over there so we'll see how it turns awesome. out but guys you guys are hearing about this what are your thoughts on a new tomb raider series uh, it being at amazon uh, about um um waller bridge writing it um definitely let me know your thoughts down in the comment section below